our life went digital over the last year. And uh, about at that time, Gaia X is going to start, a European project for a European data space. With this data ecosystem, Europe targets to create value from data, drive technology, and create a system based on operational excellence for the data exchange in Europe and throughout. For a short moment, I would like to take you to the world of data. Globally, data value was estimated to be about 310 billion euro in the year 2019. And it is supposed to grow to about 830 billion by the year 2025. The estimated volume growth goes by the factor of five during that time, from now 33 zettabytes to about 175 zettabytes. Interesting for us is the comparison of the data value per million citizens between Europe and the US. While the US has less citizens than Europe in comparison, the factor of data value per million citizens is by the factor of five towards the US. As one of the reasons, we can estimate that many European citizens and companies are hosting data in the US. This is a good motivation to start a European data ecosystem. It came up as a Franco-German cooperation and it by now has about 15 member states with a large number of more states coming from Europe and globally. GAIA-X is aligned with the European Commission and its data strategy as published. A strong alliance of companies and organizations are now joining. We have more than 800 participants at this moment from about 350 or more companies and organizations. We have participation from domains like industry and manufacturing, this is the world that we know, mobility, energy, finance, health, public sector, smart living and agriculture. Three out of four organizations are private companies. About half of them are small and medium enterprises. Those groups have together developed 49 use cases from eight domains and have grown the specifications and the requirements process for Gaia-X. Gaia-X follows principles based on European values openness and transparency for the data sharing system, a common layer of authenticity and trust, digital sovereignty and self-determination, user friendliness for infrastructure providers and for user consumers at the same time, modularity and interoperability for the participating parties. It shall provide a basis for free market access under European values and shall provide systems common to the European data protection that we know and value. As a result of this process, Gaia will provide an intermediate layer, which you see here as a green layer, which will provide and govern the use and access to the system, the so-called federated services. The federated services will govern and connect the data exchange between users in their user domains in different industries and economic sectors and the world of infrastructure providers which have a simplified and accelerated access to their customer base by the use of the federated services consisting of architecture and policies, a common layer for identity and trust, data sovereignty principles, and a federated catalog. The objectives of the participating parties are to create a standard and test criteria for conformity to use GAIA-X. The GAIA-X Association will also provide fundamental services just as the uh, distribution of digital tokens or certificates for access and the service catalog which is mentioned before. It will foster the software communities which care about the open source projects for the federated services and organize the interaction between other communities 
in their industries and user domains. And to facilitate data space creations, stimuli will be created by uh, research programs in this space. The objectives of GAIA-X are to provide the standard, to create the policy rules for access and participation, um, provide for the implementation of those standards within participated parties, and create the federated services uh, as described before. GAIA-X finds broad support. At this moment, over 160 companies have signed on, not only from Europe, but also from other parts of the world, like USA, the United Kingdom, Switzerland, Singapore, China or Japan. Not only do we have user companies worldwide for GAIA-X, but also support and interest by the hyperscalers uh, from Asia and from North America uh, for their European customer base. Data spaces will advance science, society and economies in the future. Especially the exchange of data in between those domains and sectors are of interest because it will strongly advance future data services and applications. National hubs will organize the exchange between the interested parties and the GAIA-X association to create interfaces for users in their domains and the federated services provided by the association. Um, the current status is that in France and Germany, Hubs are established. Finland was very fast and is ready to go as well. And many other countries in Europe are providing and planning and um, projecting national hubs in the same way. Gaia-X will drive technology for the next generation of data economy. User requirements have established a catalog of interconnecting services and what we call today the federated catalog. This federated catalog will be provided for all market participants in different economy domains and industry domains to provide for this interconnecting layer that everyone needs and everyone is building by himself. This will provide for accelerated and easier data exchange and be an interesting system for future data services. The timeline towards GAIA-X is packed with events and uh, deliverables over the next year. In the March and quarter two timeframe, specification documents and federation services specifications shall be available. And in the third quarter of the year, first demonstrator projects will validate those and an alpha version of the federated services uh, shall establish. In the meantime, the local hubs are forming to connect to GAIA-X, also in our industry. Why should we need and use GAIA-X in the automation industry? Let us have a look at reality. In a typical industry 4.0 project today, thousands of data points need to be connected and today are mostly uh, done in one-to-one -one projects between machine builders, between machine operators, between manufacturers, between IoT platforms, between ERP and IT software firms, and between MES operators. And one can see that the amount of labor going into such a data space project is significant and oftentimes quite laborious. With GAIA-X, this part of the projects can be simplified. Automation is the core of many investment goods. In the future, we will meet our clients on GAIA-X. That is one reason to join. Automation also means abstraction. We have in our industry the skills and the tools to provide for GAIA-X. And the strong participation by market companions from automation shows the interest in GAIA-X. GAIA-X will accelerate and simplify data sharing Either we do this by ourselves, as best for our domain, or we have to use what others provide. Why would we wait? Let us join the effort.